Hi guys, welcome back to another bright episode of the show, Eat and with Tunes, proudly sponsored by Vapido City. And this is your forever happy child, T to the U to the N E S. Guess what? Why am I so excited? Why am I so pumped up? Why am I so vibeous? Vibeous is my word. Take it or you take it. <laughs> my own very city, Lagos, Nigeria, is going back to normal. See, like I am so excited. Things are beginning to come back to normal. Our solution centers are being shut down. You know, our OMB numbers have you know increased, and we can now come out to vibe. You see, this 2020 year is overrated. And we're never gonna forget it never but guess what the year is not over you can still come out to do one or two things you want to do you can see achieve something do not use that as an excuse to sit back relax and procrastinate don't kill your future anyways let's get started you already know how we're doing starting with your award-winning ever strong dancer guess who guess the legend guess she Ka Fee baby, the award-winning dancer. She's good, man. Dance legend Kafi is working towards health insurance for Nigerian dancers. Kafiat Shafawa Meh, popularly known as Kafi through our Creative Arts Foundation for Youth. Kafi Foundation is working together with the stakeholders to bring health insurance to Nigerian dancers following the spate of health challenges and death leading to the loss of you know lives among them kathy and stakeholders in the industry including healthcare providers health management organizations life coaches dance group leaders and dance artists converged to prefer sustainable healthcare due to a two-day virtual conference tagged dance to health i love this she quoted or she says i quote we are great to start small in lagos state by running with a proper organizational structure proper registration of dancers within local government health by uni putting on a system a sustainable support and sponsorship is the way to go <laughs> excuse me this conference is an ongoing conversation that was proposed to run twice per month kathy said these are legends you get me Aside from the healthcare insurance initiative, Coffee Through Our Foundation is also launching a mental support group care where they can meet twice a month. Like a legend is a legend. Like Coffee is so passionate about dance and even dancers, she's what we call what? A legend. She's a professional dancer. And um, she's just too good. She's not about just dancing. She has taken it as a profession. She has taken it as a career path. And she's doing just well. And trust me, it's not video vixen dancing. It is actual dance. Dance art. So, man. Kathy, this is for you. Now, moving on to the next story. Into the music industry. And guess what? This gist is actually coming from Reminis. Let's go there. Reminis says he got to know his family better when he took a break from music. Wonderful. I mean, that one and a half year, I got to know my children better. Spend more time with my family. I was home. Then I wasn't releasing music. A lot of people were like, Reminis, how far? What's that mean? I was like, okay. I'm okay. I was just playing games, getting to know my children. Children. I mean, for like two months now, I only speak Yoruba to my children. He said, fantastic. My first daughter plays the keyboard, he said. However, Remini says he played a major role in influencing his daughter's interest in playing the keyboard. That's a father. He saw that this music could actually, you know, try to distance him. It changed. It set back. Since the coronavirus pandemic crippled a lot of social activities around the world, many people, including celebrities, have been busy and they found new habit you see if music if you think music is going to distort you from something though it's your career it's where you get your money from you can take a break just like reminis did just like Nicki Minaj did take a break get your family together put one or two things together get to know your children don't just do tours and travel around the world and you don't even know if your children is good in mathematics or english i'm not saying you should kill your career but you should balance it music life family balance everything man it's not biggie hold on now moving on to bb niger 2020 i told you if you ain't watching you better go start now because i will be infusing in my episode if i love the show this housemates are fun and this season is going to be boom in fact it has started exploding because it's locked down and they are really giving it to us hot hot like this housemates only god knows where they came from so from my last episode i found out that just like me most people like lakon are star in the house and glad but it's just that something is wrong with this guy these days who observed that lakon has lost focus lakon to gf4 i don't know every car he is like she gets marine spirits also over shadow lakon because lakon is now doing anyhow he's lost in the house twitter reacts as lakon suffers heartbreak evictions may be there's a way but lakon seems to be preoccupied with nursing his bleeding heart from erica's unrequited love the past few days has seen lakon repeatedly pour his heart out to erica who admitted that she's actually mentally attracted to him that girl is sick upstairs yeah she's mentally attracted but is it the body she cannot cope with lakon's body so she's imagining keep my <laughs> Erica's most recently blocking session, however, set Lekon on the edge. The once bobbing housemates had begun to sleep anywhere in their house. During last night's conversation with Bright Hole, on Thursday, Lekon admitted that he sleeps in the afternoon. 
to escape or to ease the pain of Erica's rejection. Wow. Fans of the singer have since taken to Twitter to share their thoughts on his emotional moment. Street number one says, I'm laughing because I made this tweet and I can relate to everything Lekon is going through. Below relation, hey, yeah. Unrequited love part two. Bele gone. <laughs> I just sounded like an Hollywood title. <laughs> I know I'm also not the only one in that you have once felt it, you have once loved someone who didn't intend falling for. So it too says next vision, Biggie, look on you have been given. The, I'm trying to form Biggie's voice. <laughs> you have been given the privilege of nominating two housemates for eviction. In quotes. It's Twitter I'm reading, I'll be sweet I'm reading you know. Then Lekon will now reply, kid and wire. <laughs> So three says, I clearly understand how Lekon feeling rejection is hard pill to swallow. I hope he gathers himself and face the game. That's what I'm hoping to. I'm not saying he shouldn't mourn over his rejection. But guy, gather yourself, man. Like, don't sit down and be thinking. Don't lose focus. You're the money. You're already a star out here. Like, could imagine if you leave the house, coming out to the real world. People are there to accept you. So brace up, man. Get over this good lady. Moving on to the music segment, music list for the week was pretty amazing. No spark, my shuffle list gave me the kind of vibe I wished for. So yeah, my top five most played songs, Nigerian precisely, of the week. We're starting from the bottom to the top. A music, A is life, A is vibe, A, A, A. All right, number five is Jerusalem Remix, Master KG featuring Bonner Boy. Because Bonner Boy is a neat, I call it a Nigerian song. <laughs> number four is Lolo by Omale. Omale is this guy that has been sweeping off our feet. I don't know where it came from, but it just came from nowhere and is somewhere. Number three is Amaka Disappoints Me featuring Peruzzi and Two Face. Number two is Don't Call Me Back just by Joe Boy featuring Mayo Kun. And number one is Bomb Shot by Peruzzi. This is your bomb shot, it's a gunshot, my child. That shuts my day. Hey. We vibe all along. Music is actually a healing spirit, I tell you. When you're sober and sad, you can listen to music. When you're confused, listen to music. When you're heartbroken, listen to music. When you're bored, listen to music. When you're happy, listen to music. Music got that spirit. Whatever you want, just listen to it. Blast any kind of song, listen to music. If you have tones of work to do, listen to music. Good music brings good vibes, especially when you listen with your earphones. Finally, we hit the game segment. My question for the game goes thoughts. Are you ready? All right. What color of hat or cap did I wear in episode six of my show, Eat Even With Tunes? <laughs> I'm damn serious. That's my question. So go look for it. Episode six, what color of hat or cap did I put on for that particular episode? So the hint is um, you can go to YouTube and look for it, Vapido City Arena. Remember to subscribe when you reach Geo. Thank you. Announcing my winner from the previous episode, she got the answer right. She's a subscriber on YouTube. I think she has won my goodie before, but here again, she's popping it up and I'm giving it to her. Her name is Kudirat. Kudirat is my winner. Winner, I thought to say, congratulations, girl. Congrats, well done. You did a good job representing the ladies. You are now liable to get goodies from me. So all you have to do is attention in the comment section. After you attention yourself in the comment section, you now run to my DM on Vapid of City and claim your goodies. If not, you say go, you say go. Channel where they say go. Keep winning, guys. Always be at a lot to watch my latest episode on YouTube, Vapid of City, and Facebook, and drop your right answer. Good luck. I'm actually waiting to see. <laughs> I'm waiting to see what you guys write in the comment section. Episode six, yo, Tobashi, no goodie for you. <laughs> now we have come to the end of this episode. It's been fun all the way with you watching me and chilling. I love you always. Thank you for the support so far. I love you, baby. Always remember to subscribe to Vapor City Arena. Hit the like button, drop your comment, share, and enjoy the video as always and remember to tag your friends on vapid city i always tell you people tag your friends on vapid city on facebook on youtube tell them how much oh my goodness you've enjoyed the show and you don't want them to miss out on it tag all of them april 25 tag them east six tag them marcelo tag all your friends you people should tag all of the rats that want my group now now tag your friend <laughs> my jeez ah uh, i'm trying to remember another name ah uh. Ah, uh, don't worry. I'll catch you guys in the comment section. You guys are doing so well and I appreciate you. Muloya. And I
as you know, this show is proudly sponsored by Vapro City. So do want to keep visiting the Nigerian social entertainment website, VapraoCity.com. And a good thing is, if you are active and effective, you might one day become the mayor of the city and win an amazing, busted, busted cash prize. Anyways, I'm going to take it now. The answer to my previous episode is 10,000 Naira. So that is the amount the mayor of the city on the website is going to be winning. That's if you're always engaging, always posting, always commenting, liking, if your presence is 100% on the website you are gonna be announced just for the week ten thousand naira last and last one because you are just enjoying your save and having fun behind your keypad you're gonna get keyboard you're gonna get ten thousand naira ha <laughs> ha have they not done enough you will still come and collect goodie from me again ha <laughs> ha so this life is sweet man <laughs> so what are you waiting for why are you darling so go log on to www.vaperocity.com and of course as you do know eat a show drops every saturday do not miss out stay connected and stay tuned this is your favorite girl t to the youth the nes calling from lagos nigeria doing the sign out right about now and peace out <laughs>